<clears throat> Hello everyone, my name is Karen. Welcome back to the Day is Gone Let's Play and what is getting close to being our final, final episodes of this series. I'm very excited to finish it off. Like, I'm, I've enjoyed the hell out of my time playing this game, but it, it is at that point where, you know, we're going to get close. To, we're close to the end and I'm ready to, to be done with it, you know. It, it's been a hell of a ride with this game. I'm very excited, like... To get the secret ending, get to the point where Days Gone, you know, is finished, main main story wise for me. Um, and then focus a little bit more on the new game plus and survival and stuff like that. And uh, get through more of this game and, and get to really, really enjoy the game, you know. I'm running for this. Why am I running for this? I could have driven. Um, my hope is we'll be done soon. I, I think a two to three, maybe four episodes, we should be done. Um, depending on how long each horde takes, depending on how long the mission with O'Brien takes, depending on how much I record re right now. Like, I'm recording another episode. Like, this is recorded after last week's episode. <coughs> um, so I can record it in advance, you know, get, get an episode ready to go. Because, like I said, we're very close to finishing this game completely, like, 100% of the fucking story is almost done you know all we got to do is pretty much finish hordes get the last collectible and that's the game platinum uh and then all i really got to do is do the rest of the stuff to get to 100 percent of the trophies and after that unless they make a sequel i'm done in the world of days gone like unfortunately that's that's the case like i really wish it wasn't but that is unfortunately the case like I will be done with the, the world of Days Gone unless they announce a sequel. Um, which sucks, because I really, really do want a sequel to this game. It sets up for a sequel. Like, everything I know about it, I've heard about it, says it sets up really well for a sequel. The game didn't sell terribly. They said it didn't sell meet expectations, but it sold really fucking well. It sold well enough to warrant getting a sequel, it, it is, is basically what I'm trying to say here. Like... <laughs> I wasn't trying to do that. Um, but yeah, like, <coughs> fuck. <coughs> I'm coughing more than I mean to. I've not been coughing that much recently, so it's it's very annoying to cough now while I'm trying to record and enjoy myself. There's probably dust getting kicked up in my room or something somewhere, and I just don't realize it because I'm stupid. Okay, horde's not in here. That would have been really cool, though, if the horde was in here. Is the growler one of the things I'm missing for this? I, I feel like it, it was. Okay. Because I keep getting the supplies, I'm like, why am I missing? Why can I still not make this? I'm missing a growler. What can, What do I need for the pro- Oh, I can make some, make some proximate bombs. Fuck, yes. Oh, I'm gonna fucking enjoy this horde. <coughs> horde fight, fuck me. Bob, let's go grab some water and take some coughing medicine, because uh, it's bad. Like, this, this, is, this cough is getting horrible right now. I haven't coughed like this in a while, so. Might as well make a napalm. Rather than a regular one. Makes more sense. I can't make that. I need gunpowder for that. Okay. I'm trying to, like, figure out what I'm missing for certain things. Because I want to try to make more supplies. Obviously. Um, and, and get a little bit more prepared for, for some of these hordes. Because that last horde in the last episode was not very easy. Like, granted, you guys are saying, how was it not very easy? You literally just did nothing. Like, none of them attacked you. Like, yeah, that's the case. Like, none of them attacked me or anything, pretty much. But, that was a fucking huge horde. And the unfortunate part is, when the hordes are bigger like that, it does warrant some issue of having to take a while to actually fucking sit there and... And, uh have to like sit there and and do a lot of work to kill them like it's not easy in those situations when there's such a large horde even if it's not coming after me it's still gonna take a while so i gotta go to that one 
it's 200 something meters away. You know, it's it's still one of those things. It's gonna take a while. Even if none of them are attacking me, the horde's huge. Oh fucking goddamn! I pressed the wrong button. Fucking bitch. That's what I thought, motherfucker. I thought I heard the horde, and then all of a sudden the wolf just fucking attacked me out of nowhere. What the? Oh, this game, dude. Why is it giving me so many invisible hordes? For those of you who wonder how the horde system works, I, I believe I know how it works. And, oh, there it is. Okay. I'm going to say this. I think I know how it works. Based on do it. the way it it's it sets up, I, I believe the way it works is very simple. Um I wasted that on one fucking thing. God damn it. Um the reason there's three locations Um is that I believe those are three possible locations where it could be sitting. Um, I'd have to look up to see if that's if this is exactly how it works. I be, like I said, I'm pretty sure I, I have it understood of how exactly the horde system works in this game. So it gives you three possible locations where the horde could be sitting slash resting. And then because the hordes wander. And, you know, that's how the game, like, the game tells you they wander around looking for food at night. There's the possibility, like you guys just saw with this one, I'm pretty sure it's, it's set up that there's the possibility that, you know, depending on when you find the horde, it could be wandering around between those three locations. And that's why they give you three. It's basically saying, well, this horde could be in one of these three locations, or this horde could be sitting somewhere between them you know and like this one was pretty middle of all three of them so that was that was kind of cool oh fuck i gotta run into the horde now god damn it no nope. no nope. roll deacon st john roll i have no idea how i just drive that part run deacon st john run Motherfucker. Hit me. There's another one down, baby. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. <gasps> oh my god. I did not think I was about to get that one. Not even a little bit. Alright. There is another horde down. We are gonna go now and do this horde killer one. Um I'm hoping as you guys saw last episode was called Horde Killer. I'm hoping I can call this one Horde Killer Finished. But we'll see, I guess. I'm I'm really another fucking screamer, really? Dude, what the fuck is with all these screamers? Come on. Come on. Oh, there we go. Holy fuck, that was not a good situation. I 100% did not expect to miss the fucking first shot. <coughs> <coughs> oh, that was a bitch. All right, but that was a pretty pretty easy horde. Uh, I think the proximity bomb and the napalm, uh, uh, napalm cocktail uh, Molotov really fucking helped in that situation. Like, like I said, if if you're going to do late game hordes. They help so much. There's so many things you can fucking get in the late game that helps so much. Like, that if you had early game, you're getting through this game in, like, five seconds flat with hordes. Like, that's not even going to be a fucking challenge for you. I do that. Pick that back up. Fuel up the bike. I, I said... Fuel up the bike. Deacon, fuel up the bike. All right, we got about 20 minutes left, so see see what I mean? Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, like it is insanely di insanely different doing a horde late in this game than it is early in this game. Because early in the game, it was taking me, like, a full episode to even try 
to kill the horde, to even get close to killing the horde. Ah, my ears! I hate the way the screen looks too when that happens. It really fucks with my head, man. It makes it so difficult for me to focus. Um, you know, early in the game, I'm taking like a full episode to try to kill a horde. Now I'm finishing him in 10 fucking minutes. Going on to a second horde, finishing that one within 10 minutes, and then pretty much, you know, depending on how hard the horde is, finishing in 10 minutes at least. I, obviously, last episode, well, we finished two within the 30 minutes, but the second one took like 20 fucking minutes because it was a bigger horde and it was being kind of glitchy. We're saving it. I heard the horde. I was like, I hear it. I don't know where it's at, but I fucking hear it. I'm like, I'm saving the second I can. I was like, damn game, come on. All right, we're gonna save it again. Hop off to Bizak. Grab the gun. And here we go. I probably could have went for this one a little bit safer and gone for some distance, but whatever. Like I said, guys, this gun, if the horde is in a fucking big crowd like this, holy shit, does this fucking work. Granted, it only works if you're paying attention. And now you see why I just saved it. <laughs> Damn. I really did not pay attention there. <laughs> I, uh, I was not paying attention to how fast they swarmed around me. I was paying attention to everything else, and then they just swarmed so hard, so fast. Oh, Brian. What? Why are you on this channel? What the? What? We tried contacting you on our channel. Well, I lost the radio the night that shit went down. Did she uh... make it out? Your wife. I hear the horde. No thanks to you. Oh, there it is. All right, now we'll pick them off from some distance. So I would say your best bet is find somewhere you can kind of funnel them really easily to a smaller amount of like runners in the front and go from there. It also seems like the harder the hordes are, the less there is around to use to your advantage. Or maybe, or the smaller the hordes are, sorry. Um, because this one, like, the hard one that we did last episode. Had like a bunch of explosives around him. I'm not seeing any in this area. Fucking god damn piece of shit. Get out of my face. God. Assholes. Alright, let's re. Ah, we don't need to refill yet. This one's pretty good. I did not realize how much ammo I still left in this gun. Uh, let's go to the pistol. I missed. I hit. I hit. I missed. It's dead, apparently. It just didn't give me the red X for some reason. I missed. I hit. Fuck you. Fuck. Fuck you. Oh, there's a few more left than I expected. Switch to the chopper, to the Tommy gun, and we go, and y'all are dead. Get murked, motherfuckers. Get murked. All right, there's another one down. Holy shit, how many more do we have left to go? Two, three, oh my god. Let's go on to the next one. On, on to the next, on, on to the next one. I'm gonna go refill the ammo from the saddlebags because, uh, duh. We're gonna save the game again because, uh, duh. We'll drive back over there if we really have to. Uh, that doesn't bother me. Driving back over there doesn't bother me. It's it's just making sure I have saves before and after hordes. Just is, is kind of the important thing for me. Before and after a horde, save the game. Always a good idea, guys. If you die, you then get to redo the horde. And you don't have to worry about losing your spot. And in the case of you finishing the horde, 
you make sure that you don't fucking have to redo a hard that you already finished. I've plenty of times, unfortunately, uh, forgotten to save after finishing a horde and had to redo the fucking thing. And, uh, that is never fun. Like, at all. It is one of the most aggravatingly difficult things in the world. Having to redo a difficult ass horde. Granted, all your shit's back, but you still have to redo an entire horde that you just finished because you're a dumbass and forgot to save. But, you know, it happens. It happens to the best of us. And the worst of us. Um, but the worst of us can suck a dick about it. It's not my problem that you failed to fucking save. The best of us, yeah, it, it, it's... It, I'm sorry, guys. That happens. For the people who are assholes, you deserved it. For the people who don't want Days Gone 2, you deserve to forget about your save after killing that horde and having to restart that entire horde and redo the entire thing. For the people who do want Days Gone 2, the people who are not assholes... Yeah, it sucks. I know. I'm sorry. I feel your pain. Alright, let's move on to the next location this horde could potentially be at. Um, so we have three locations, like I said, it's, it's a pretty nice system they have here. What the fuck just happened? Why did it not ramp up like it was supposed to? Alright, location number two is empty, and location three is a cave, which means there's a very good chance I'm about to see a shitload of gold but I was about to say a shitload of golden bodies, and, uh, that is a big old negatory, my friends. What the fuck? Where is this horde at? Um, it must be... It's daytime, though, isn't it? Like, it's pretty much daytime. Are they wandering seriously still? It's very light out. Normally, they don't wander at this point. Oh, 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 we have a fucking thing to knock over. That should be our last collectible right there, actually. I thought... Apparently, I thought wrong. I thought that was part of the collectibles, isn't it? Um, I'm so incredibly confused right now, you guys. I don't know where this horde's at. Oh, is this one a cave too? No. Dude, what in the fuck? I don't know where this cave... I just heard a gunshot. I don't know where this... Okay, that's not the horde. Come on. There we go. Okay, ow. I tried to fucking roll or something to make that fall not be bad. Did not work. Run across the water. I'm doing that. Well, I'm going to save these two. I'll go check my Snapchat because I just got a Snapchat from somebody. Probably just, I think it's just a streak, but still. Might as well check it while I'm doing something easy. Scrap. Okay. I got this. Hang on. Hey, Keep hey, it's not safe out here in this shit. I know where there's uh, a camp. Unfortunately. Yeah, yeah. I'll go. I'll go. Crater Lake, Wizard Island. There's a camp there. You gotta ask for James Weaver. Okay, cool. Yeah, I get it. You thought you were gonna die. I hate how long these fucking Telling conversations take. John, Deacon. They know who I am. Okay, I don't Don't know how the other guy technically got cut off, like his were cut, but whatever. Maybe the other dude did it after he fucking Sorry. took six years to talk with me. 
Hey, I can make a new proximity bomb. Fuck yeah. Wrong proximity, because proximity are a lot more fun. Not really, because they can actually waste the bomb very easily with those. But also, I really enjoy using the proximity ones a little bit better. Especially because now, or because for the most part, I didn't fucking know how to set the other ones off. So, but now that I do, I'll probably make a little bit more, a few more remote bombs every now and then. Alright, let's run back up to the bike. That hopefully won't hurt. Okay, good. Did a little nice, nice little roll at the end there. I was like, fuck, please don't let me die to that. That would have really sucked if I just died to that water right there. Um, nothing there. Dude, seriously, again, like, nothing. This horde's just fucking not here. And the worst part is, this is not the first time this game has done this to me, where the horde has just been invisible and not anywhere it's supposed to be. Very confused. I'm assuming it's supposed to be in the cave right now. Like, it should theoretically... Because these are, like, two of my last three hordes. Theoretically, it should be in one of these locations. I guess let's try to swap to this other horde. Wait. Uh, Juniper Ridge. Rum Eagle. Okay, so we want to go to Juniper Ridge. We're going to do... Okay, that's a deer. I saw, I saw the fucking gold and thought for a second I may have found part of the horde. Maybe they can bind into like a super horde somehow. Because the thing is, because I know what some people may be thinking, like, what if you already killed this horde during your normal missions, like during the actual game? But the problem is, if that was the case, it wouldn't be on here. Like, the thing is... Oh, fuck. Well, that was a fucking waste, that proximity bomb. I should've just made a remote bomb. Made a remote bomb and let them all out of this fucking cave right into it. God damn it. Run, Deacon St. John. Run. Right, Molotov. Molotov. Run a little bit more. And shadow chopper. Roll. Run, Sam Whitworth. Run. Run like the wind. Shoot. Roll. Run. Run. Reload. Turn around. Shoot. Shoot. shoot, shoot, shoot. Ah, run. Reload. Missed my, uh, my, ma my roll on that that one because of the fucking fact they were there so fast. Alright. <clears throat> I got what? Like, maybe two zombies left. Maybe one. Maybe three. Knowing this game, somehow I have like 15. I'm not kidding. I feel like it's been about this low the last few hordes where it's just been like, oh hey, there's like 70 zombies left. Like, what the fuck, game? What do you mean there's that many left? Wumpa! Stealth kill! Is that it? No? I did hear a zombie outside of the cave, so there's still gotta be one... One straggler dicking around out here somewhere. Oh! I see the red. He's close. Or he was. There you are, you motherfucker. I'm gonna run up and knife him in the fucking neck. There we go. There's another horde down. Two to fucking go. Let's go. We got two more. We got Rumry Rum Gulch and uh, Man the Mount Bailey horde. Now, neither of these hordes has shown up for me for some reason. Both of them have just glitched the fuck out, it looks like. Which is kind of unfortunate. Because it means we may not even be able to get all the hordes. Uh, which is bullshit. I really want to get the rest of the hordes. So, we're going to see what we can do here in a minute. And uh, hopefully, find a way to do this uh, really well. Um, I might have to... I just realized I might have to restart my New Game Plus playthrough. Because the secret ending, I think, gives you a secret weapon. That uh, I don't think I can actually use without having a New Game Plus playthrough save. That's up to date with the ending. With the secret ending. 
I might be wrong, but we'll uh, we'll see about that. Maybe I'll uh, restart my new game plus playthrough. All right, you motherfuckers inside the cave. No, you ain't. Are these two really just not gonna fucking show up for me? But I'm be really pissed if two hordes just don't want to show up for me. I can't get this thing to 100%. I wanted this to be the last one. Well, theoretically, I wanted this to be the last one with us hunting hordes. Um, but unfortunately, due to time constraints and the fact that the game has pretty much just said, fuck you, these two hordes are going to be completely fucking invisible for you for the majority of the time, um, it looks like that may not be the case. See if we can get over there. Let's see if this horde spawns in. Because maybe it's just a, a thing of like they have a set spawn path for these for a few of them or something. Like maybe there's just a way that they're supposed to spawn in late game or something. And you know, maybe it's a hey, you haven't done this certain horde yet, or you haven't done this thing yet, so blah 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 blah, you can't do this horde yet. Maybe. Other or the game is just glitching the fuck out on me and it's being annoying. Either of those are possible. But we're going to travel towards that horde section. See if I can find it. If I find it, I'll probably just save the game. I'll probably just get away from the horde and save the game. And then we'll do it next episode. Finish up the last, uh... Last remaining hordes in the next episode. Try to get that collectible and then I'll uh, be done with it. I hate the fact that I have to fucking travel through this shit. Although I suppose it gives me opportunity to buy ammo and stuff, so that's fine. So we'll uh, we'll turn stuff in that we can turn in. Probably not much for food. Yep, that's what I figured. Should be able to turn in a decent amount of bounties though, so that's nice. Hello, Deacon. Do the bounties. What's up, Sal? Deacon, you come back in one piece. I'm right. nice. Uh, Deacon, how's life, man? Fantastic. Give me hey, your grenades. Deke. Okay, now that's more like it. Oh, big spender. All right. Ho! When it goes for the upgrade. Nice. Primary sidearm. Buying a new one, right? Come on, am I right? Phil. There you go. And Phil. Huh? All right. Uh, okay. Onward to the bike. Deke. What's up, Caleb? Doing? Hey, Caleb. Hey, Deke. See you around. And out we go. Hopefully, we can get to this horde area pretty quick. I wish there was like fucking. Why does it take me there? That doesn't make sense to me. Why does it take me. Why did it take me through Wizard Island? That doesn't make sense. Why did it tell me to go through Wizard Island? I thought that was weird that it was telling me to go through Wizard Island. That was confusing. That was extremely confusing. Why did it take me from Diamond Lake to Wizard Island to get to that horde that's right next to to Diamond Lake? Yeah, like look at this. Look at the way the first way it took me like it was weird, man. This is the faster way. Why did the game not just drive me through this? Okay, here we go. I'm not even going to waste my time on that bear. Not even a little bit. I mean, granted, I already wasted a little bit, but you guys know. Wolf, however, I will try to kill as quick as I can. All right, horde location number one is a bust. Oh, don't let these hordes be glitched out. If they are, I mean, like if they are, we have no other choice. We'll just finish the episode next. We'll finish the game next episode and then uh, be done with it, I guess. 
Oh, fuck. Up the, let's do the old Skyrim tactic. And instead of a horse, we have a motorcycle. Uh, absolute premature. We're just gonna go see if this is up here, and if it's not, then so be it. We'll, uh, I don't know. We'll we'll figure something out next episode. Yeah, man. Like all three locations for both of these fucking hordes are just empty. Oh, 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 never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. Okay, 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 fuck, 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 we gotta... Drive away. Oh my god, this thing's not on flat ground, so it won't stop moving. Let's drive down to this little camp. I guess we'll get off the bike. Like, why is my bike still moving? Jesus. And we'll save it right here. And we'll uh, we'll do the next, that horde and the last horde in the next episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Stay golden. Peace.